LinkedIn is obviously insanely useful for every working person, not to mention for every job seeker and student. But using LinkedIn as a job search tool isn't always obvious to beginners or to casual LinkedIn users. If what you do on LinkedIn is just updating your profile from time to time and waiting for headhunters or hiring managers to reach you out, you are missing out on a lot of opportunities. If we haven't met before, I'm Marat from Emotion, myemotion.com, human resources and career services agency. Look me up on LinkedIn. On this channel, I train and coach you to ace your job interviews fast, to gain confidence as a professional and learn to deal with corporate politics, being a better person yourself first. If you are looking for LinkedIn beginner's guide on how to use LinkedIn and make your profile stand out, check out my other videos through the card on the right side of your screen. This video is a tutorial on how to use LinkedIn to get a job. Seven simple tips on how to get hired for your desired role using your LinkedIn profile. Before we proceed further, I would like to remind you to subscribe to my channel below and hitting the little bell so you won't miss out on the latest career and personal growth content. And if you stick with me until the end of this video, I share a bonus tip on how to access unpublished jobs vacancies which might only be visible in LinkedIn groups. If you already have a complete LinkedIn profile with a good profile photo, a headline and a complete summary, you are ready to go to tip number one. Create the list of your target employers and follow them on LinkedIn. Identifying specific companies where you would like to be employed is extremely helpful for your LinkedIn search. Make your target list and follow these target companies on LinkedIn. This is a great way of keeping up on what is happening with their business, on changes and even trends of the field in general. This is how it's done. I'll be going back and forth to the laptop to illustrate it properly. Click on the search box at the top of your LinkedIn page and type the name of the company you are looking for. Press Enter. Click the More drop-down and select Companies. Click Follow button next to the company name in the search results list. Or click the company name and visit the company's LinkedIn page, where there is also a Follow button you can click. Identify inside connections at your target companies. One of LinkedIn's greatest strengths is the ability to help you locate the key players at the companies which you would like to work. The way to do this is to use LinkedIn search or an advanced search to find people at your target companies in the field you would like to work in. The easiest way is doing it the same way as while searching for a company through the search bar at the top of the page. Select the LinkedIn member from the suggestions in the drop-down or click the search icon to run the search. Once you've found the person you are looking for, select the member's name to view his or her profile. They don't have to carry the exact job title you are going for. They could just be in the same department or work at these companies as recruiters. Get noticed and get connected with these professionals. There are a few ways of getting noticed by professionals at your target companies and eventually getting connected. Follow these people at your target companies which you've identified. Always show your profile while visiting their profiles. Don't browse anonymously. I'll show you later how to do this step by step. Check their posts, interact with them by liking or commenting on those. After some time, ask to connect with them using a personalized message and not the default LinkedIn empty template. Remember, don't ask them for a job at this point. Most companies have some kind of employee referral program. When you find out about a job opening at your target company, it should be a win-win for you and your company contact if they bring your resume to the attention of the hiring manager or the HR team assigned to fill the position. This way you will minimize 
the probability of your resume disappearing among a huge list of applicants and maximize the chances of being contacted. Make yourself accessible on LinkedIn. One common mistake on LinkedIn is not making it clear how others can reach you via email or phone. That's why it's important to list at least your email address in your profile, such as in your summary, for example. Also, allow anyone to see your profile. You can do this by changing your public profile visibility. To show your public profile or to customize it, click the Me icon at the top of your LinkedIn homepage. Click View Profile, Edit Public Profile and URL on the right rail. Make your profile public under the Edit Visibility section on the right side. Select which sections you'd like to display or hide. Your basic information is displayed by default. The changes made will be saved automatically. This way you allow recruiters, potential employers, former colleagues and anyone else with an interest to take a look. The more eyes are seeing what you have to offer, the more opportunities are generated. And it also shows that you have nothing to hide. Use LinkedIn to search for recruiters in your industry and connect with them. For example, if you are in marketing, you can do a search on marketing recruiters. Start your LinkedIn search with the search bar at the top. Type your query, marketing recruiter in this case. Choose a people search from the options offered. View these profiles and once you've found the person you are looking for, follow the same steps as while getting connected with your target company connections. Use LinkedIn job search tool to identify the desired roles and locations. Aside from opportunities in your target companies, you can use LinkedIn job search tool to find the desired roles and the geographical locations you would be willing to move to if it is required for the position. This will help you to focus your search and get the most productive results. And this is how it's done. Type the position you are looking for in the search bar at the top of your LinkedIn page or directly in the LinkedIn jobs page. I'll search for an HR manager role. When the results come up, select Jobs located just below the search bar. Next, add your desired city, region or country. Your search results should look similar to this video. Let's check an HR manager position, based in Paris, for example. You may decide if you wish to add more filters to your search. LinkedIn makes this really easy as there are several filters at the top of the page. You can filter the results by when the job was listed. This allows you to select jobs posted in the last 24 hours, the past week, the past month, or at any time. You can filter by your target company's list using the company filter. Make your results even more relevant by using the experience level filter. Apply to the desired roles through the LinkedIn job search results. Once you have finished filtering your search, you can begin going through the job search results, looking for good matches. You can either quickly scan the results and click the Save button to check it out later. Or you can move on and apply right away. Click the Easy Apply button if the job posting includes this feature. To use the Easy Apply, simply complete all the required fields and submit your application. Required fields can differ from job to job and may include contact information, job preferences, resume and work experience. Here we just need a contact number. Attaching a resume is optional. Keep in mind that if you see the apply button instead of the easy apply, you'll be directed to the company's website or job board to continue the application process.
You can also find other information at the top of each LinkedIn job posting. Position title Company Location When the job was posted How many views it has How many of your listed skills match the required skills listed by the job poster? How many applicants have already applied? The company size and industry Number of employees that you are currently connected to at the company When you scroll below the top section, you will see a job description that is provided by the company and responsibilities of the position. If you have a LinkedIn Premium account, you can also see how you stack up against other candidates. Skills Seniority Education Location There is also a percentage here, which means that you are in the top 25 among all the applicants based on their LinkedIn profile. Also, LinkedIn Premium Service gives you an inside look on the company's hiring trends, including who they hire and from where. Overall health and growth of the company so you could see if it matches with your expectations. Bonus tip! Check the jobs posted in LinkedIn groups. You can join up to 100 LinkedIn groups at the same time. There are groups based on everything imaginable. If you want more information on them, check out my other LinkedIn profile video. There are many LinkedIn groups that exist to help people with their job search. To find groups, click on the work icon at the right top of your LinkedIn page. And a drop-down will offer you several options, including an option for groups. LinkedIn groups usually have jobs relevant to their field. And some groups can be really active. That is why this could be another way of finding jobs which are not listed on the LinkedIn's paid job posting service. Another bonus tip is to keep your LinkedIn profile fresh. LinkedIn profile should be an up-to-date, living and breathing document, not a static, online, send-and-forget resume. Keep your profile alive. Try commenting on updates and even share updates on topics related to your field. Stay active but not too active. To stay visible on LinkedIn, share links to interesting articles, photos and videos always relevant to business or to your profession. Remember, this isn't Facebook, so don't just post for the sake of posting or you risk to become annoying. Thanks for staying with me till the end. Feel free to leave your questions and comments. And make sure you subscribe to Emotion by Marat by using the subscribe button below. And check out my next video.